Hello world, it's another Monday. You are welcome to World on the Go with Benga Durojai. Happy new month once again. Welcome to the first working week of the month of October 2021. I hear in my spirit that song, O Lord Boboro, that is the one with the mighty hand is turning things around. I believe God is turning things around for your good this month in the name of Jesus Christ. You'll be a living testimony of positive turnarounds in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So what is the word on the go for this week? It's a continuation of what we had last week. First Chronicles chapter 4 verse 9 and 10. The Bible says, And Jabez was more honorable than all his brethren. Remember what I told you the last time? This is what the Bible introduced Jabez with. Despite the fact that it was caused sorrow from birth, but the Bible didn't talk about that initially. The Bible talked about his present status. He was more honorable than all his brethren. I believe God for you. And all the pains and sorrows of the past will be long forgotten in your life. In the name of Jesus Christ, the sweeter part of your life has just begun. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So we conclude with the 10th verse. It says, And Jabez called on the God of Israel. No wonder his story changed in verse 9. He called upon the God of Israel. The Bible says in James chapter 5, verse 13, Is any merry? Let him sing. Is any afflicted? Let him pray. Prayer is the key to every affliction. The Bible says, They that call upon the name of the Lord, they shall be saved. They shall be delivered. Hallelujah. I want to challenge you as you go this week. Call upon God and you will see torn around. Maybe you have been caused sorrow. You have been encountering frustration in all your journeys. God will rewrite your story. In the name of Jesus Christ, Jabez asked for four things. He said, God, make me the epitome of blessing. Bless me indeed. Let me become the definition of blessing. Number two, enlarge my territory. Number three, let your hand be with me. Let it be obvious to everyone that God is with this man. And say number four, keep me from evil that it might not grieve me. I'm glad to announce to you the latter part of verse 10. The Bible says the God of Israel granted him that which he requested. As you go this week, I see God make you become the epitome of blessing. God will bless you indeed. God will enlarge your capacity. You will enlarge your territory. You will enlarge your influence. In the name of Jesus Christ, God will keep you from evil. In the name of Jesus Christ, and God's hand will be evident in every area of your life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, your own story too has become rewritten by the power of God and then the pleasant part, the sweet part, the great part is what the world will begin to see from now. In the name of Jesus Christ, it's going to be a week of turnarounds for you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Always remember, I love you so much. God bless you. Have a glorious week and a great month.